Uh, good afternoon, all, and welcome to my live broadcast number 288. Broadcasting live from Auckland, New Zealand. My name is Keith Pure, and I'm addressing the Billion Coin community. Uh, before we go up to the blog, or before we go into the send button meeting, which happened earlier on today in New Zealand time, there's a couple of couple of um, posts in the blog that I want to have a look at before we go right into the send button meeting blog. Let me just share the screen a second. Okay. Um, it's this one here, right here. Admin credits will al admin credits allow new members up to a month to gather the funds to pay their own admin fee and to have an income from TBC to cover it profitably. So if you read on from there and then just go and watch the, the video, you you'll have a you'll have some good knowledge of what they what they're telling you, but it's sort of quite straightforward at the top of you. And the next one We'll have another breaking record. Um, we'll open that one up. Okay, another record breaking week. Right. And here it is here. Look how we've just shot up. We're there right now. 3.440 million people. That's up there. Now, I think it says well, last three four eight double four was the total. So we really we're really growing. And it's um yeah, it's a lot of thanks to those admin credits while we are growing. Uh, I don't think we would have gotten this far. Um yesterday when we read the blog yesterday uh, issued was uh, 650,000 odd of admin credits that were issued, but there hasn't been any result to how many of those had been used. So further from that, we'll just go and have a look what happened in the blog on a Tuesday morning, New Zealand time. Okay, that's the October 7th, 2019 10 button meeting starts now. We will be hosting the Send Button Live broadcast in all languages on Monday, October 7, 2019 at 9 a.m. PDT and 5 p.m. WAT. Now the yeah, PDT, PDT. Will, will be um, Pacific Daylight Time that will be on, on in America and the WAT will be West African Time. So if you do not have a send button on, you are not allowed into the meeting. For those of you that do have a send button, do not share this link with anyone else. The link will be available at 8.45 a.m. PDT on Monday, October 7th. Inside your Kringle Cash back office. The meeting starts promptly at 9 a.m. PDT. Show up and collect up to 1 million cookies. So I'll just elaborate on this 1 million cookies. For those who are broadcasters and uh, who and go and watch these send button meetings, there's, um, there's a million free cookies for each send button that you that you go and view and of course there's always a, a, a keyword in there that you insert or add, submit uh, in the same um, uh, country's um, send button which is 10. There is 10 meetings sent in different languages but there's only around seven to eight of them that are always there on a weekly basis so out of the 10, you're looking max at eight of those only. 
Okay, um, that's the one show up. Uh, and collect one million cookies. Uh, what is TBC Confidential? I can't tell you. You'll need to attend the send button meeting. Find out. If you have ever wondered why we call these send button meetings, it's because admin will turn off the send button of both the buyer and seller of any transaction or, or transaction if any discounting is. So for the new ones who don't know what they, what admin means here, if you if you are selling if you are selling a coin and you have a buyer, then and and let's just say the transaction was done at forty grains or approximately hundred US dollars, then that's what that coin goes for. It doesn't go for twenty five grains. And or does it go for 60 grains? Okay. If it's 40 grains, then that's what it goes for. So anything above and below that is called pretty much discounted. And that's when, and that is the main reason why we call these 10 button meetings. I'd like to bring some clarity to, to why admin and the type of blockchain we use unknown. Short answer is security is very expensive. TBC is rolling out and not fully developed at this time yet. It is highly functional today. The admin fee is ridiculously low to keep the barrier to entry into the TBC community very low. We are on a mission to help the poor rise out of poverty. So we have kept the cost down as much as possible to run a sustainable operation. Remaining unknown reduces the chance of attacks so that we can continue to grow organically. As funds grow, so will our tech and admin structure. And with enough funds, high levels of security can be put into place. We are self-funded operation on the admin fee, we are debt free, and we are self-regulated. And another main thing is we are private. We're totally private from, we're nothing to do with the public sector, nothing to do with the coin cap at all. Okay, transactions over 400 grains will result in the TBC commissioner reaching out by email to collect details of the transaction to make sure equal value was exchanged to prevent discounting of our coins. Total transactions done within a 24-hour period over 2,000 grains will result in the TBC commissioner reaching out by email to collect details of the transaction to make sure equal value was exchanged to prevent discounting of all our coins. Okay. Now, here's a big one here. Con you first contact the commissioner in advance. Okay, in advance, contact the commissioner of completing a 40,000 grain or greater transaction to show proof ahead of time that a transaction of that size has been done for something of equal value to prevent massive discounting of our coins. TBC admin pays the salary of the TBC commissioner who protects all of us from those that would discount our coins from their lawful value. And we all should be thankful that the value of our coins are protected. It takes a great deal of admin fees to pay the annual salary of our TBC commissioner. And this is just one way admin supports the TBC community with the admin fees collected ongoing. Now, congratulations, MB Derek. 
the second heavy hitter and TBC with over 1,000 paid sign-ups within the calendar month. So even that's quite a few that these two here always appear for that amount of sign-ups, which is over a 1,000, and that's on a monthly basis. I think they've done something like three each one, so three, maybe four. I sort of lost count. And those are the heavy hitter, there's the transaction. So that's um, the uh, Bitcoin transaction from to Ace and Embay. Uh, we will be paying out the heavy hitter bonus to Embay Derek and Ace Fletcher during the live send button meeting broadcast equal to 30% of the Bitcoin received in admin fees from the referral of both of our current heavy hitters. So, Embay Derek will receive 5, $5,337. So, H. Fletcher will receive $5,480. You may have one or two more extra there. English Bitcoin Contest, first place, Williams, uh, Ab Ab Abdulwali, and Abdul Satar. Second, second place or third place, Kemen Kamini. After this contest, uh, we will no longer pay out winnings to unidentified winners like Seiko uh, came and require a head and shoulders picture of the winning contestant uploaded to their profile. Fair enough. And then obviously they're referring to this person here who's come um, second place with 117 uh, sign-ups and and this gentleman here in the middle with the 125 and the third place going to this one here with 107. So French Bitcoin contest, uh, first place in Bay Direct and Tally Samuel is second place. Third place goes to Afrotech Services and this is what they're talking about. They want real names, real faces and not these here. After this contest, we want, there, there we go, it's the same thing. Okay, um, tag along, tongue along, Bitcoin contest, first place, Ace Fletcher, second place, Mary Lou Brow, and third place, it's Rebut, it's a, this one applies down here too, see, we've got no faces, Who's so. So there won't be any payouts to these who don't have a head and shoulder face. There we go. These are through wallet transactions in English, French, and tongue lock. Okay. Compare this week with recent 90-day uh, period. It's a record break. Record break a week or month, shall I say. And we have... A total of 4,800 and looks like uh, 44. So there you have it, so it's cool, right? We have anal analyzed the results of the Bitcoin contest and have found that the TBC members in Cameroon led the whole TBC community in growth with 112 contestants and 1167 paid sign ups. Last week, 40, last week, 49 countries had 868 contestants. Last week, out of the full-time database, which has 6,100 members in it. Nigeria, Philippines, Ivory Coast, Ghana, India, South America, Papua New Guinea, Benin, Togo, Uganda, Italy, Belgium, New Zealand, Rwanda, United States, Canada, Bangladesh, Burkina Faso, Greece, Rwanda, Hong Kong, Cambodia, and Japan 
or all strong contenders last week with double digit and triple digit numbers. We want to thank all of those that made an effort to recruit paid signups last week. This is a brand new week and you have another chance to win a week from now. We also have 1,205 merchants now, of which 175 are admin reviewed and have qualified for the merchant promo. Oh. And as that number grows, it will be easier to share TVC with others. We also are looking for more send button hosts to cover the other languages, such as Russian, Greek, Japanese, Spanish, German, and Italian, since we are seeing good growth there. Okay. Um, to, to actually be in the Bitcoin bounty and contest, you need to be a full-timer. So, and if we don't know how to be a full-timer, up here, in order to participate in Bitcoin contest, you need to be a qualified full time. To qualify, you need need a complete profile. You have to have attended a view, attended or viewed a send button meeting, and you must have at least two active paid referrals below. You. And there you have it. Then. Um, check just click on the check button it'll tell you if you are a full-timer yeah. if you have not updated your kcbo profile to be listed in the full-timer database you should do that now so that we can recognize your recruiting efforts for you and your country you need to update your profile to a full-timer to collect Bitcoin bounties. So yes, new members need to get two paid signups before they can see the Bitcoin bounty menu under the account area of KCBO. They can collect the Bitcoin bounty even on their first two paid signups that they needed to qualify as a full timer. We have three Bitcoin contests happening right now, English, Tungalog and French. If you didn't follow the instructions last week to change your language by placing the correct keyword into the send button meeting of the language you want to switch to, then you will need, will be in the de default English this week. In order to switch to a different language for next week, you have to go into the bottom of the profile page of the KCBO and make the change this week's. Okay, and here it is here. Okay, new language. So whichever you want Chinese and you can open up Chinese, whatever language you want, just open it up, search for it, and then there and then update. Okay, well here we have. Mind you, this um, holiday um, 2019 promo will keep going until we find 1 million plus with one whole coin or more, TBC coins I'm talking about, um, then it will stay open until we have reached that number. And I'll come across that number a wee bit later on because I'm sure it comes up somewhere down Okay, purchase of 40 grains. Now the GR is short for grains, those for the new people of Kringle will entitle you to at least get one whole UBC coin and maximize your cookie reward for recruiting new members into TBC. One TBC coin today is worth $10.2 million. Okay. And $10 million is a massive amount of money. Even a transaction as small as four grain is rewarded too. See the chart above. So here's the four grain here. Okay. 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 
there's your referral cookie reward, your transaction cookie rewards. Okay. All going there. Yeah. If you do not complete a transaction, if you have not completed a transaction yet, now is the time to get that done so you can collect the rewards. Contact your sponsor or TBC leader to complete your transaction today. Broadcasters get the maximum cookie rewards available. So become a TBC broadcaster. See, they're talking about broadcasters even down here. And your maximum cookie rewards uh, is one million free cookies. And now that's a lot, and, and a million million free cookies, uh, yeah, that's a lot of cookies there. That's a lot of cookies. Now, even if you're not, and you attend the send button meeting, each each send button that you, you attend and view or view is worth a thousand cookies free. So we have the send button meeting uh, once a week. And New Zealand uh, is, is on a Tuesday morning, New Zealand time. Um, the rest of the world is, I believe, is a Monday morning. Okay, what do we got here? Membership, that's something new. Don't put your TBC membership at risk. Wow, well, what are they talking about? Private means private. Like any organizers, any organization, we keep our private things private and they should never be discussed in public in any way ever. We have a public education and the private education areas inside KCBO. Pay close attention to the warning at the top of the private education. Well, I guess there's something's gone wrong here while we're reading this. This is private education for active members only. Do not read the content on this page on a broadcast or copy any of the content on any social media or blog on the internet or distribute any content offline. One-on-one -on -one chats between members are allowed, but group chats of three or more parties is not allowed. Violators will have membership. Ooh, wow, something's happened. Something has happened, folks, or your membership will be revoked. Admin credits seem to be the final one of the day. Admin credits. Since August 1st, 2019, we have issued a total, oh, here we go, of 650,817 admin credits and our growth is exploding because of the regular active members get two admin credits a week and merchant admin reviewed members get an additional 100 admin credits. Now for those who don't know what these admin credits are, if you're paid yours, well you should know if you've got an on admin credit because that applies to the next ones that come under you on your two. So as other words are saying, you're getting them free. So that's how that works. Okay, use them or lose them. So that applies to the 100 admin credits that the, that the uh, merchants get, and even to the two that uh, the ordinary members get. During the final distribution phase of TBC, this has set our membership growth on fire. Please encourage all members that have joined through the admin credits to make the October admin fee payment if they haven't already done so. There is so much to gain by staying active in TBC today. Also, let's get all of our members to commit, commit making the admin fee payments on the 1st of November, which is a redemption month. 
Our target is 50,000 payments on November 1st. We can do this. Now, 50,000 payments, I, I, I would say these are not in credit, admin credits. I don't think the, these are admin credits they're talking about. 50,000 payments. Okay. And it's got at the last four words, we can do this. So we'll just stop sharing. And there was some exciting information in that blog. So I don't know what happened with that last piece. Um, something's obviously happened out in the public arena. Um, we you allowed to and not allowed to share information. So I don't, I can't really speak too much about that because so, I, I don't know what they're talking about. But um, it will come up on Facebook. Somebody will let the cat out of the bag. Anyway, that's me for the day. And um, same time um, uh, tomorrow afternoon, 3.30 p.m. And that is uh, Wednesday. And we'll see you then and go in peace. Hey.